More often than not, it's going to be really difficult for you to figure out where the spots are in your photos. Now, spots can be anything. It can be blemishes, it can be camera dust, it can be anything. And you don't want to fiddle with the spots after you have done a lot of post processing because that can be destructive. Also, at the same time, after doing a lot of post processing, the spots become much more visible than it was when you started with the image. So here's an awesome tip that will allow you to quickly figure out where the spots are. So here's what you got to do. Create an adjustment layer, curves adjustment layer. Create an anchor point right here on the third line and take it all the way up. Okay. Create another anchor point right here and take it all the way down, just like a sine curve. Okay. Just do it this way. And there you go. Just close it right now. And you can see the spots very clearly. You can see all the blemishes. You can see all the spots here. These are all camera dust very easily. Now, all you have to do, make a copy of the background layer. There we will remove all kinds of spots. Take the healing brush tool and take sample from here. Let's remove this. Take sample from here. Let's remove this one. Let's remove this one. Let's remove this carefully. There you go. Take sample from here and let's remove this. There you go. And it's very easy to remove blemishes this way. See, all the blemishes have become so much more visible. Very easily you can spot that. Okay, there's a blemish, there's a blemish, there's a blemish. Blemish. <laughs> okay, so you just simply remove it. Now, I, I know it looks kind of weird, but yes, you can just simply remove it really, really easily. There you go. There you go. There you go. Gone. 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 Okay. You get the idea, right? Now, once you're done with everything, you can always turn off the curves adjustment layer. You can always throw it away. So that was a quick tip there. Hope that was helpful. And if that was, make sure to give us a like. And also don't forget to subscribe and not just subscribe. Click on that bell button so that you don't miss anything. I'll see you guys in my next one. Till then, stay tuned and make sure that you keep creating.